Hi, my name is Dan Wiggins, and today we're going to discuss the technical workings of high-bypass turbofan engines. For the sake of simplicity, this presentation will focus on one model, the General Electric GE90. The General Electric GE90 turbofan engine is the most powerful jet engine available today, with some variants providing up to 115,000 pounds of thrust. The GE90 is currently used on the Boeing 777 family of airliners. Like all jet engines, the GE90 has four major components. The fan, the compressor, the combustion chamber, and the turbines. While all jet engines have these components, there are some things that GE has done with this engine to improve efficiency. We will touch on these as we go through the parts of the engine in more detail. Now, let's take a closer look at how the engine works. We begin at the front of the engine where air is sucked in through the main fan. The fan is constructed of 22 fan blades that are made of carbon fiber with a leading edge reinforced with titanium. This strengthens the blade while keeping it light. Only about 15% of the air that passes through this large fan actually circulates through the core of the engine. The remaining 85% is bypassed along the outside of the engine case, allowing for more thrust, reduced noise, and increased efficiency. After passing through the main fan, the air that goes into the core of the engine passes through the low and high speed compressor fans. The purpose of these fans is to speed up and pressurize the air to prepare it for the next step, combustion. After passing through the low and high speed compressor fans, the air enters the combustion chamber where fuel is added and the mixture is ignited. On the GE90 engine, a double dome annular combustion chamber is used to enable extremely efficient combustion. After igniting in the combustion chamber, the air moves rearward at a high velocity through first the high and then the low speed turbines. These turbines turn the compressors and the fan in the front of the engine, starting the process all over again. This has been a brief overview of the GE90 high bypass turbofan engine. Thank you for watching.